In my discussions with clients, one of the questions I'm asked most often is, how do I see biometrics playing a key role in payments in the future? Biometrics are very simply a way to identify a person uniquely. So someone might know your password or your PIN uh, or find it out, but they cannot be you. Forty years ago, we started in fingerprint recognition, and as the market has evolved, we have moved from fingerprint to also facial and iris recognition, uh, and we're enabling new markets like banking, payments. Some studies show that fingerprint recognition uh, is very well perceived in Europe. Today, we're seeing that the most heavily used biometric technology is definitely fingerprint. It's probably the least intrusive and the support it's had from mobile device manufacturers has clearly helped. What we're also seeing is that different technologies will work well in different environments. If I'm standing in Paddington Station authenticating myself to pick up my ticket, using voice recognition is probably not the best way to go. I'm unlikely potentially to want to use facial recognition software when I'm standing in a queue at a checkout. I think what we'll learn over time is what are the technologies that work best in those different environments and use cases. I don't think there's one solution that will fit uh, every use case. Multi-biometrics or multi-factor authentication more generally uh, is really the trend uh, for the market. So being able to combine uh, a number of different identification factors and biometrics is actually even better than just focusing on one. The reality is, is that it is not a binary yes or no response. There can be false acceptance rates, there can be false rejection rates. But on the other hand, if it's used in conjunction with using the device itself as a form of authentication, all these things build to effectively create an increasingly reliable score by which all the stakeholders can make their call as to whether or not you are who you say you are. Very simply, I think biometrics are here to make life uh, more simple uh, and more secure uh, in, in an increasingly connected and digital world. The people that customers most trust to provide their biometric data to is their banks. So we're reviewing what opportunity for cooperation exists for us to facilitate that on behalf of the banks so that Visa as one of the most trusted brands in the world can help deliver that experience consistently in an open network.